Hi, I'm Situ. I'm an XR artist, and that means everything to do with different digital realities like virtual reality, augmented reality. And today we'll be talking about augmented reality books. So, Modern Galaxis became my first augmented reality comic book. It's the story of a paranoid time traveller. The book is set out like his own private diary. You'll see drawings, you'll see lots of crazy writing like a madman's diary. And then the idea is that you use the augmented reality app to reveal his secret journal. You're almost like an investigator. And if you put your phone close to the book, you will discover little notes, like the text is replaced in the book with some new text in the app. So the app is telling you a different story to what is printed on the page. As a storyteller and also as an enthusiast of sort of technologies, I like that we can break the convention of traditional storytelling with a device like this. Not only are we adding a layer, we're adding animation, we're adding audio, we're changing the text that's printed on the page. And I like playing around with that aspect of it, you know, I like challenging the reader. When I finished Modern Palaxis, I got a lot of emails asking how did you create that? I decided to release a tool to allow people to create their own augmented reality art and to kick off that tool, I created Prosthetic Reality. I invited all these artists that I know around the world to use my tool and to submit their creation, their augmented reality artwork. It resulted in about 45 artists' work. I think the future for augmented reality books and all augmented reality experiences are going to become more prevalent when we have augmented reality glasses. So I imagine in the future, in the near future, we'll probably see a, one of those famous launch days at Apple where they say something like, this is the new MacBook, and then they will only put on a pair of glasses. And the world will go, what? That's a MacBook? And it's suggesting that we will just see the information floating out in front of us. And this will be the sort of the tipping point when we enter into like a full augmented reality future. I think that will happen within the next five years. And all of these experiments that we've been doing will become a part of the mainstream culture for how we experience digital art.